Celebrations there in New York, which is celebrating the start of 2018. I can tell you sir, there are some uh, hardy souls there because temperatures are around minus 12 Celsius in Times Square. We understand that's the second coldest New Year's Eve in New York on record. The coldest was in 1917 when it was minus 17 degrees Celsius. So uh, people wrapped up well and truly there to celebrate the start of 2018 in New York. Things were a little warmer in the UK, which saw in 2018 with spectacular fireworks displays in both London and Edinburgh. More than 100,000 people took to the streets to witness the events. Skies Down Whitehead was with the crowds in central London. Twelve thousand fireworks in twelve minutes. London's spectacular show saw in 2018 in style. Millions tuned in around the world, with a hundred thousand ticket holders lining the Thames. London celebrations have been truly international. People have come from all over the world, from Taiwan, from Italy, from Germany, from France, even Mexico, to enjoy the New Year's Eve celebrations. I was so thrilled to see such a splendid and brilliant show. And the best thing about it is to see it with my friends to share this precious moment. It was amazing, it was beautiful, amazing show, the best experience in my life. The theme of the capital show was gender equality, marking 100 years this year since women first got the vote. 
The second half of the firework music was female artists only. In Edinburgh, 75,000 gathered to see in the new year. It was the 25th year of the city's structured Hogmanay party. Organisers and police will be relieved that London's event passed without incident. While for the crowds in the capital, celebrations continued well into the night. Dan Whitehead, Sky News in London. Well, let's have a look now at how the rest of the world has seen in 2018. Sydney hosting its annual fireworks extravaganza to welcome in the new year. It was the biggest display the city's ever seen. Eight tonnes of fireworks were used and the fireworks spectacular featured rainbow colours to mark the Marriage Equality Act which was passed in November. Plenty of colour as thousands gathered at Victoria Harbour in Hong Kong for a 10-minute musical fireworks show launched from both land and sea. In Taiwan, this was the scene at the 101 Tower in Taipei. Well, some different scenes in Jakarta, the Indonesian capital, where hundreds of couples took part in mass weddings as the clock struck midnight. The world's tallest building, the Burj Khalifa in Dubai, was lit up in a laser and lights display, showcasing the United Arab Emirates colours of green, white, red and black. This was the view across the river in Moscow, where temperatures were below freezing. In Greece, fireworks were blasted over the Acropolis of Athens. This was the scene at Berlin's Brandenburg Gate. Organisers set up a safe zone for women at the event after hundreds of women reported being attacked by groups of men two years ago at celebrations in Cologne.